So what happened was, we're in the same aisle as this kid and he really wanted these fruit roll-ups. And his mother was being a hard ass about it, saying she wasn't gonna buy them for him. But the kid was getting whiny about it, which makes sense because he's five years old and he really wants these roll-ups. But his mother wouldn't give in. In fact, she starts ignoring him completely, just turns her face away and pretends he's not there. Just goes about her shopping, like that's going to shut him up or teach him a lesson or something. Case closed sort of thing. But that only gets him more upset. So that pissed me off for some reason. The way she was ignoring him, instead of trying to explain why he couldn't have them. So I walked over to her, I said, <clears throat> It's only three bucks, why don't you just get him the fucking roll-ups? <laughs> and she looked a little miffed, but she smiled a little, I don't know why, and explained to me that she didn't want her son eating candy. And so I said, it wasn't actually candy, in fact fruit roll-ups are relatively healthy and they're made with real fruit and why not give him a treat? And she told me to mind my own business and then tried to move her cart around me, but ran over my foot by accident, so I smacked her. <laughs> I know, it was awful. And then the boy started crying and I felt terrible, but she pissed me off. I wanted to shake her. Look at him, don't pretend he isn't there. But I didn't say that. I just stood there, kind of startled, and she was startled. Oh, and then mum came over and told me to go back to the car, which I did not need her to do.